Hey guys, it's Stone W, and we're gonna do a quick review as well as unboxing of this rechargeable mouse. This is a Bluetooth wireless mouse, but it also has a dongle for 2.4 gigahertz um, wireless mouse too. It also has rainbow colors that it turns on. It works for Windows, Android Auto, and Mac, which is nice. And it looks very sleek. So it comes in different colors as well. The one I got was silver. You could charge this. It's also rechargeable too, so you don't need batteries for this thing. That's why I wanted to. I didn't want to keep on you know, replacing AA batteries on my other rechargeable mouse. So you could basically, it also comes with a um, USB C adapter for Macs as well. It works for Android too, or any other device that actually has a USB C um, converter. And of course, it has a micro USB for charging as well. But this USB C converter is a really big thing. It converts it down to USB um, A, which is cool. And then that dongle is actually right underneath the mouse. There's a silver one, there's two buttons. There's also a button on top for the DPI. And you know, there's the on, off, and Bluetooth or the dongle 2.4 gigahertz one. So the switch is on the bottom. The sensor is also on the bottom as well. So overall, it has a, it's nice. It's a very inexpensive replacement for a Mac or a PC, or you know, if you're working remotely or on um, or traveling, it's good to actually bring it. It's actually very lightweight too. In fact, it's very lightweight, but the profile is actually very low. So if you're looking for something really thin and low, then it's great. It is a dual mode mouse. Like I said, you can switch from Bluetooth or that 2.4 gigahertz dongle. So either way, it's pretty good. It moves pretty well. You actually changed it DPI. The dongle is kind of big and bulky um, for to convert it, but hey, it came with it. I think I prefer like a wired dongle that's a little extended so I can fit it. I noticed that when you switch it to Bluetooth, it's actually um, like a blue color, but if you switch it to the uh, 2.4 gigahertz, it's actually greenish color for the rainbow. So I guess that's how it tells it. Now compared to my gaming mouse that I've got before, uh, from uh, Red Dragon, uh, which is really cool. It's a lot. <laughs> the clicking motion is a lot more fun to click on on the gaming one than that of this uh, really low profile one. But I guess if you're traveling or working at, at school or something else, it's very convenient to actually have a wireless mouse instead of having a wired mouse. So in that case, it's actually quite worth it. No super lighting and stuff. It just has that uh, rainbow color light around it. Uh, but like I said, it doesn't have all the other access buttons like on the sides and customizable buttons. It just basically has the two left and right buttons and you know the uh, scroll scroll wheel and DPI button. Now, of course, my Red Dragon um, mouse came with a combo as well as like the Flag Power mouse. I love these things because they're nice and they're lit for and colored for my desk, which I thought was really cool. And I still love using both of them. Uh, and they, they are a lot more comfortable than a the wireless mouse, but the wireless mouse is convenient when I travel or if, you know, basically at, if I'm traveling and to throw my backpack because I really don't want to carry a, a corded mouse anytime like that. I have full reviews of the Red Dragon as well as Flag Power um, gaming mouse and keyboard combos. And yeah, anyways, thanks for watching guys. This is Stone Debbie. I hope this was helpful to you and you know, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Please like, subscribe, hit the bell button for the Stone W channel if you like this video. Of course, you know, stay tuned for more videos as well as check out the other videos on the Stone W channel, like DIYs on how to replace your bat key fob batteries or some fun projects like LED lights, adding LED lights to your car or your house. That's really fun. Or Costco finds. I do a lot of Costco finds because I go there pretty much every few days. So if there's any fun deals, I usually post it. And of course, reviews of products I get either at Costco or Amazon or whatever else. And I'll stay so stay tuned for more. Check it out, check it out later. Bye bye.